were you pressured by your parents to do something other than music? And when did you have that defining moment that music is what I want to do? My parents were black people who were born in the 1930s in Mobile, Alabama. My mother would tell us stories of how the KKK would chase them after school sometimes, how it was a given that you be called nigger. It was a given that you can't go in that place. Oh no, you can't eat in that place. You can't talk to that person that way. So that was their reality when they were growing up. So when they saw this musically inclined, interested in maybe singing one day, son, that made them a little uncomfortable, as you could imagine. Dad really saw education as the means to change for us as Black people. He himself went back to school after he was an officer and got his uh, so, so, de degree to, to become a science. detective. I remember telling my dad, I don't want to go to college. I'm, I'm thinking about going to this fashion institute. He was really interested in going to fashion school. And I was like, really? I we didn't, didn't know. I didn't even know that. And he said, dad was like, oh, no, you ain't doing that. <laughs> Not my son. My father looked at me like, you are a black man. I get a little emotional thinking about it. 